So you were fed up of the Fire Stick, Fire TV devices. You've now bought a new device, maybe the Xiaomi Mi Box third generation, maybe the on 4K Pro, maybe the Google Streamer, lots of other devices out there. You now want to use your favorite UK streaming applications. You open up the Play Store and you want to search for maybe the iPlayer. Let's type that in. So BBC, here we can see iPlayer. Let's click on that. You give it a second and what do you see? It tells you that that application by the British Broadcasting Corporation isn't available on Google Play on this device. So even though your device is a fully certified device, the Xiaomi Mi Box third generation does support Netflix in 4K, 4K Prime Video. So why can't I use these official certified applications on my certified box? Well, Unfortunately, the companies behind these applications, they only certify a select few boxes like the Nvidia Shield, all of the Fire Stick, Fire TV devices are fully certified. But lots of these Android TV devices, these Google TV devices, unfortunately don't have access to these particular applications. Some of them have access to uh, certain applications like for example, ITV, like maybe Channel 4. Other devices have none of these UK applications. So unfortunately, if you have one of those devices, there was no previous easy way to get them onto your device until today. So we can see on my Xiaomi Mi Box third generation, I can press the home key. We can see on my device, I seem to have a custom version of this application here. I can open that up, give that a second. I'm now inside the application. I can browse all of the content, the VOD content, the live TV content. I can continue watching something and uh, let's try this one here. One click, less than a few seconds, we are straight into the episodes. And that just demonstrates that this custom version is working properly on this box and really will work properly on any box as long as the box is certified. I also have the custom version of ITV and Channel 4. Let's try this one here first. Just to show you that all of the applications are working absolutely fine. We're now inside the content. If I just try one of these random ones. Three, two, one, click on watch now. And again, we can see this version is also working fine on this box. That's working great. Let's back out of that. And the final test is the channel four app. Let's open that up, continue watching. Click on resume. And again, we can see guys, all of these applications, even though they may not be fully certified for this box, as you can see, are working absolutely fine. Let's go back. Did I install channel five? Let's click on that. And let's just try one thing in here. Uh, it's a random one here. Five, four, three, two, one. And that's also working absolutely fine. So really guys, you can see if you are looking for these applications, even though you may not be able to find them directly in the Play Store, you can see now with these custom versions, they'll work absolutely fine. So how can we get them? Well, let's press the home key. Now, before we continue, let me just quickly share this QR code that if you are looking for a fantastic offer for a ridiculously fast VPN, stay safe online, change your IP address, access geo-locked content, protect your privacy, you definitely want to go ahead and scan this QR code for a superb discount. I already have downloaded or installed on my device, which you can get free from the Play Store. Let's open that up. And we now want to type in the short code, which is 53402, or you can just type in techdoctoruk.com. Let me do the short code. So five, three, four, zero, two. Let's click on go. Let's give that a second. And just while you're waiting, guys, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, YouTube is actually telling me that more than 75% of you are watching my content, but you haven't actually subscribed. It takes a couple of seconds. It's absolutely free. A great way to support the channel if you are looking for the best tips and tricks for your fire Fire sticks, Android TVs, really all of your streaming devices. Make sure you are subscribed with all notifications. Thank you. Okay, so once you get to my site, let's go to the hamburger menu, which is one of the three lines. Let's click on that. Click on tutorials. Now, I did actually cover this some time back, so you may have to scroll down a bit. And what you're looking for when you scroll down is where it says get UK applications. For all devices here we are let's click on that you can now see some information about the applications why they may be restricted underneath all of that you should now have a bunch of links allowing you to install any of these applications that you like so for a quick test let's just do uh the first one iplayer let's click on that you can now scroll down click on the green download button 
and that will download the latest working version directly onto your device. Even though it says update, I've already got it installed, but let's just click on that anyway. Give that a second. And actually then install, that says that's now installed. So go through the list, install whichever applications you like, and you can go ahead and enjoy that content. Now, of course, as these are UK based applications, if you want to enjoy this content from anywhere in the world, you do have to have a UK based IP address. Now, the easiest way to do that is just to use a VPN because when you activate your VPN, you can now choose a virtual location from anywhere in the world. So you can get a UK based IP address for your UK applications. You can get a USA based IP address for other streaming applications because when you use a VPN, you are now no longer using your own IP address. Rather, you are using an IP address provided from your VPN service provider. And with this different IP address, you can then go ahead and unlock different content from around the world. You can unlock the entire Netflix library and really just keep yourself safe online. I've been using this for more than, I think, five years now. I have tried other VPNs during that time. I think I tried Nord for a bit. I tried Surfshark for a bit. I tried Express for a bit. But ultimately, I always come back to IPVanish because it just gives me that consistent performance. It allows me to access all of the applications I want to access and works great on all of my devices because they give you those unlimited connections. So one account, you can install it on 10 Fire Sticks, five laptops, 300 TVs, really as many devices as you like. So that kind of flexibility and that amazing price point, which you can see here for just over $2 a month, it really is a fantastic offer. Using my link does help support the channel. So many thanks for doing that. Do have a look in the video description and pinned comment. You can also take advantage of this free eSIM. So wherever you are in the world, you can now take advantage of this special offer. So lots of great freebies, great price, great performance, works on all of your devices. And again, at this price point, it's definitely worthwhile checking out. So really appreciate your support. Do like and share this video and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.